Today, I'm going to show you how to use the search interface to search for activities and then replay activities in a movie like form called Audit Trails. Imagine a forensic situation in which something unusual happened and you need to search for specific sessions to investigate the root cause of the unusual event. Let's see this in the search interface. This is how the search interface looks. Sessions are displayed, sorted by date and time by default, and the search interface is updated in real time to always show the most up-to-date information. Notice how many sessions are available. This is how you specify a time range. Notice that once you click on the date, you can choose to search by the hour and minute. For now, we will leave it blank. Click search or press enter. Notice that the number of sessions has been reduced. A maximum of 7500 sessions are displayed. If the search result returns more than 7500 sessions, a message will be displayed and then you can further restrict your search if required. Also note that if the result list changes, you get notified. You can also quickly select from the list of preset time ranges. For now, let's clear the dates we specified earlier. Here's how. You can toggle between two different views. You can quickly sort the columns. For example, to see the longest session, click Duration. For our training, let's filter on connections by a user called Test User. Notice all the sessions by this user. You can add more search filters. Let's narrow our search on a specific server address. The specified server address from Test User is displayed. You can exclude events from your search list. Here is how. Notice how the specified server address by test user is now excluded from the list. Add as many search filters as you need. To save your search filters for future use, simply bookmark the page in your browser. If you have purchased the analytics module and you have analytics data, here is how you can search for unusual behavior. Notice how score results indicating unusual behavior between a score of 80 and 100 are displayed. Search in the screen contents in the sessions. Let's suppose we don't know the exact word we are searching for. You can use wildcards, boolean expressions and so on. Fuzzy search can be helpful if you are unsure about the spelling of a word. You can combine search terms. Check out detailed information about the session. Notice the different tabs. On the Details tab, view details of analytics, a quick look at session details, interesting events, and monitoring information. You can replay the session activities as a movie. Read more about search in the PSM Admin Guide. Or get in touch, if you have any feedback or questions.